Well, the larger the fish is, the more expensive it could be. Experts tell us just recently the price for these imported koi fish has gone up. These are Japanese koi. Uh, they were imported from Japan, and uh, so they've got royal parents. Tony Creble has been raising imported Japanese koi fish for almost 20 years. Koi fish are great. They're tough. They're hardy. Uh, they live a long time. They'll live longer than you or me. They're called a wet pet. One of these colorful pets can cost you anywhere from a few bucks to thousands of dollars. You know, if you pay $5,000 for a fish, that's a huge loss. That's like, that's worse than getting your TV stolen. It appears thieves are taking notice. Just recently, two large koi fish at the Tulsa's County Extension Office garden vanished. Uh, lately, we've, we've had a couple that, that grew legs and walked away. Brian Jervin says the fish had been on display here at the pond for about 10 years. Yeah, the ones that, that came up missing were probably about two pounds, uh, probably about a foot and a half to two foot long. And um, that, that um, probably too big for a bird to take away. The pond sits along a busy road. We're looking at putting cameras up, and, and uh, that you know that's just a, a cost that we don't necessarily need. Last week, this koi named Mama Cass was taken from a Bixby business. Cravel says these fish are extremely delicate and will die if not properly handled. In order to steal fish, you have to know how to transport them, how to catch them, how to keep them alive, and. Uh, you know, a novice probably doesn't know how to do that. And so this keeps.